All right, so you've ditched the purple site. You're done with it. You've come over to the amazing greener side of Astro. The outside of Kick. The grass is actually greener on Flanders. So and you're using the bot Botrix, but you don't know really how to use it. I need help, and I need help quick. <laughs> well, we're going to show you how to use that bad boy today. <laughs> and we're actually going to be going over how to use your widgets and your chat bot with Botrix today on Kick. So make sure you all pay attention. All right, so you are using Botrix for your Kick live streams, and you're a little lost on how to set up widgets and chatbot. Well, we've got you covered here. So you want to make sure, of course, we are in the settings for Kick. Uh, always make sure that you're hitting those settings for Kick, because as you can see, when we hit our settings for Discord, everything changes. So make sure you guys are linked with your uh, kick and in your kick settings. If you don't know how to link your kick or how to link your Discord, go ahead and visit our last video and it'll show you how to link your kick, how to link your Discord, and how to set up alerts. So make sure you all check that out. But today we're on widgets. So again, we're hitting the settings. And then we're going to hit the left hand side for widgets. Now, the widget that we're going to set up today is going to be the chat widget and the emote on screen widget. As you can see, though, they have a lot of widgets here. They have a counter, subathon, go followers, uh, goal subscribers, which actually we will probably set up that one as well today. Event labels, uh, raffles, and then two new ones to come which is going to be your chat king and your e emote combo which i'm actually really excited for uh to see what happens with the channel king i feel like my chat is going to love that a lot they're going to get very interactive with that one but like i said today we're going to be adding the chat widget now this is super super easy guys um, and if you are multi-streaming, you can select to have all of these options on, but of course we are not, we are just streaming on kick. So we just want our kick one on. Now we do want to hide messages from bots personally. I don't like messages from bots. I think it's a little bit dumb. It gets a little bit annoying. You also have the option to do better TTTV emoticons, which I love. There's not a lot of bots out there that actually give the option for this, so we're going to actually keep that on. Now, you do have the option to hide old messages. Personally, I keep this on because with Botrix, if you don't keep this on, all of those messages are just going to stay on your screen forever. Forever. Now, with it being on, it'll disappear after a certain amount of time. That way you can get those fresh new messages in there and not have those old messages up. And then, of course, you can turn on hide commands as well. We personally like to keep these on because we like the rest of the chat to see the commands that are being used. And then, of course, if you are streaming on multiple platforms, you can also use the show platform icon. And that will let you know that Th say this person Kiso is actually from Twitch and then this person is actually from YouTube It'll show that in the chat messages for you. So, you know exactly where each person is coming from Last but not least we're gonna copy this of course and then we're going to Go into our OBS. We're going to add a source we're going to add our browser source. We're going to name this one Kit Chat. We're going to hit OK. Now we're going to adjust, or sorry, not adjust, but we're going to paste in our link that we. Got. Now we're going to leave this at 800 by 800, and we're actually going to adjust it as we, as you see fit, for wherever you're using your chat screen. But as you can see now, this is up and ready to go. And as you can see, that is now showing up right here in the bottom right hand corner. So any message that we do, test, chat, that's going to show up. Hi, 
Hello, how are you? So as you can see, it's about five, 10 seconds until that message disappears. And it's just sitting there very nicely on um, our screen. All right, so now that we've gone over how to link your chat to your live stream on Kick and how to make sure some things are coming through but other things are not coming through, we're actually going to show you guys now how to set up the emote on screen. That way, you can all have a bunch of really cool emotes pop up on your screen whenever anyone is using them. So again, we are going to want to be in our Botrix widgets, and we are going to now select emote on screen. This is going to be super, super easy. If you're streaming on YouTube, Twitch, or uh, Trubio, make sure these are selected on. Um, but all we're going to do here is just copy this link, bring over our OBS, add sources, Add your browser source, emotes on screen. Now we're gonna hit okay. We're going to paste our browser source. Keep this exactly like that. And then as you add it, you're going to right click it, right click your source. You're going to go to your transform and then you're going to do stretch to screen. Okay, so now you set up the emotes on screen. You set up your chat as well. Now you would like to set up a subscriber goal. One yes, please. Once that you have hit affiliate on Kick. This is a great thing to do. This is a great way to get your community active and um, want to be able to subscribe to you. It also gives them maybe a small goal that you all can try to reach to as a community together. So let's go ahead and show you guys how you set up your goal subscribers with your widgets. All right guys, so of course we're still in our bot tricks. We're in our widgets. Now we're gonna set up our goal subscribers, which is a set subscriber goal for you, for your viewers to help you reach so all we're gonna do is this is a very very easy thing to do it's awesome how easy it is we're gonna select our design and they've got um, a good amount of designs um, that you can kind of go through here they've got your clean look they've got your radius look your clean radius your sharp your rounded you've got cute and then you've got minimum Personally, for us, we're actually going to go for that sharp look. Actually, we're going to go for the... Uh, wow, I actually can't decide. We're going to go for the clean radius look. Clean radius looks good to us. Now, I love a good red. I am a big fan of red. Or we can go green with this. We're going to go red with this one. All right, so we're going to pick our bar color. Now our quantity for the goal is going to actually be 150 and our initial amount that we started with, this is personally for me, I would leave this zero. We did not start with zero. We have a, a goal for ourselves um, that we're gonna be getting into here in one second. And then we're gonna do green with the color. That's nice, I like this. And our goal is actually going to be called the Roundhouse Slap. Because if my community gets to um, 150 subs, they will get to watch me get knocked out on stream. And I'm not looking forward to it whatsoever, but it's probably gonna happen and I'm gonna be scared. I of course, we're gonna go with that Russo one. And this, boys and girls, is going to be um, how you set it up. Now we're going to, of course, copy again. We're going to bring over our OBS. We're going to add a browser source again. This one is going to be called sub goal. Add the new, paste our link, and okay. And then now you can see we have our goal right here, you can adjust to make this as big or small as you want. Personally, we're gonna set that up a little bit like that, and then we're going to move it up some, just like that. 
and there you go boys and girls now you have your sub goal set up with your box sure. this again is super super easy to do guys and now um, we can do it, it. it it only takes like a couple of seconds to do a lot of these things with the chat widget which is very nice that they make a lot of this stuff easy um I have to say I'm loving Botrix right now. I think Botrix is absolutely amazing. Um, and to be honest, it, it is like one of the best bots that you can use on your YouTube, on your Twitch, on your Kick account, on your TikTok account. It comes with great features. They're always ahead of the game. I know this sounds like a sponsorship ad, but unfortunately we're not sponsored by them. We're just enjoying the use of them a lot. But enough about Botrix because today's video again is sponsored by Dubby and we're going to be drinking on my favorite because it's now been in two videos the uh dragonade all you got to do is just pour up one scoop in the old shaker uh oh i gotta clean that go and then we give her the old shake and of course we snort what's left on the finger the old shake one more sniff oh that smells yummy oh and that's some w boys and girls make sure y'all use code w s a e army for that sweet 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 little discount so we're gonna show you all one more um, and that is going to be the chat bot for Botrix. Now the chat bot for Botrix is something that is great. It gives a lot of options uh, for moderation, for timers, uh, like timed messages in your chat and also commands in your chat. Um, so it's a great, great tool to be using. And so we're gonna show you guys how to set that one up. Alrighty, so of course we're still in our settings for our kick and now we have hit our chat bot now our first tab is our moderation and this is all the moderation options that it gives. these are all of the commands that you get to customly add to your chat these are all of the timed messages that you can add to your chat and then these of course are your modules uh which as you can see is chats alert send a message in the chat every time there is an interaction such as a welcome or a follow uh, voice messages allow your viewers to send voice messages with the command tts then there's a level system rewards your followers by giving them a level for interacting in the chat that will have to do with the loyalty system which we'll go over in a different video then you've got your point system and then you can import things from Nightbot. I'm not a big fan of Nightbot, so I don't have anything to import from them. So first we're gonna go over our moderation. Uh, moderation for me, most of the stuff is actually gonna get turned off. So, yep, that gets turned off. We, uh, emoticon turned off. I love links coming into the chat, so that can get turned off. And this can get turned off. And we're going to go ahead and confirm and save our changes on that. Now you can set up custom commands. And so for us, we would do like a command. It would be uh, exclamation point. It would be discord. And then we would say our little message. Okay. So once you have your message that you'd like to send um, when someone does this, so for us, it is our Discord. Want to join the best Discord family around? Well, come join us then, soldier. We'd love to get to know you. And then it's our Discord link. We will be turning these off for all of these platforms because there's really no need. If you'd like to have a cooldown, you may add a cooldown for this. Um, you can also set a price for this, and then you can also say which type of user uh, follower subscriber moderator super mod editor or owner may use this obviously for us it's going to be open to anyone and then we will hit done and now we have added in our custom um command so if we go to our chat and do exclamation point discord we have this amazing message that comes up and has a link that is clickable 
to our Discord. By the way, if you would like to join our lovely WSA Army Discord, uh, we do have the link down low in the description for you guys. We would love to have you. We're always giving information on how to help stream better, how to make things more interactive, how to use your social medias in the correct way. So make sure that you all get into that Discord so that you all can get linked and join in on the fun. Alrighty, now we're gonna add in our timed messages. And this is gonna be essentially the same exact thing that we did with our chat command. So we're gonna type in our message and it's gonna be, this one's gonna be for our social medias. Now we want the interval, personally, this can be anything you'd like. I'm going to make it every 30 minutes. Um, and I'm going to make it a minimum of at least three lines um, to be there if to send actually two lines for it to be there to send a message out that way the chat doesn't just get filled with um, just this bot going off and sending messages so we'll go ahead and confirm that and now we have our timed message going out so every 30 minutes we are going to have this message go out that sends the link to our YouTube so that way everyone can check it out. So we showed you guys a lot of stuff and it is really a lot of knowledge. My head hurts. But granted, a lot of the knowledge is very easy to apply and use and that is the great thing about Botrix is that it makes things easy for us to use. Cause it's easy. If you all are enjoying these videos though, make sure you all hit that like and subscribe button down below. We are new to this, we're, we're getting in the gear of things and hopefully as we continue the videos will get better and better. But I want to be better. I'm but trying to be way, better. Let's go ahead and show you guys the last thing that we wanted to show you guys today, which is the modules for Botrix. So let's go ahead and get into that guys. Alrighty, so we are still in our, of course, our Botrix and on our chatbot side. Now we're gonna wanna hit our modules tab. And the first thing that we're gonna wanna set up is our chat alerts, which is send a message in the chat every time there is an interaction such as a welcome or a follow. So we're gonna wanna to set that up. Um, we're gonna want our follows on. Thank you for the follow. Now, of course, you can change these to whatever you would like to change them to. Um, we are going to be changing these, so welcome to so once you have created all of the messages that you would like to go out, you then just hit confirm and save. And all of it's been saved, all of it's been done for you, and you are set to okay, So go. this is a very simple, very easy to use bot. Again, it's if you easy. don't know how to link very your Kick account or your Discord account to be able to use these awesome features that Botrix does have for us, make sure you all watch that last video um, in the, right here, actually, it's like, Right here, yeah, there it is. Uh, make sure you all watch that last video. Um, watch it not even show right there because I'm terrible at editing. But we love you guys. Uh, we hope that this video helped you. Uh, we're gonna be doing more videos like this, showing you guys how to use bots for your kick uh, streams, showing you how to edit content for your Twitch and many other things like this. So if you guys are liking the videos, liking what you see, Make sure y'all hit that like button. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. That way you all can get notified every single time we drop new videos, which is twice every week. And uh, make sure you all come check out Baby Girl and I live on Kick, which link is right there or down low in the description below. What's he looking at? <laughs> but again, we love you guys. We hope you all have a good one and we will see you all on the next one. Peace out, y'all.